No balls, two strikes, two outs here in the last of the first. Petrillo with his pitch. Swinging this one, a grounder over to third. Omar Carreras bobbles, picks it up. He has time, throws the first. Farrell can't scoop it, though. Gets past him, and it'll go to the fence. Rounding third is Ryan. He'll score without a throw. And heading over to third is Calcano. And so the error charged to Carreras gives Sayerville a one to nothing lead. Christian Petrillo at the plate. Petrillo looking for his first RBI of the season. Struck out looking his first time up. So I'm in at the set. And his pitch. Swinging a ground ball. Hard ground ball to second. Bobbled. And the play will be the first to get Petrillo. Run scores. Glassman comes in. That ball was hit sharply. And Ryan Cassano could not field it cleanly. Did knock it down. And was able to get the out at first. But... Glassman scores. The game is tied at one. Rodriguez moves over to third. Tan down to second. So give Chich an RBI, his first of the year. Runners take their lead. Petrillo at the set. His 3-2 pitch. Fastball hit it out to right center field. And that's going to drop in for a base hit. Coming in the score is Calcano. Holding at third is McTonic. A single and an RBI for Dan McDonald gives Sayerville a 2-1 lead. Christian H. will come up. H grounded out to second his first time up. Right-handed batter. Petrillo will make his pitch. Swing, and this one a grounder over to short. Rodriguez coming in. Gloves it. No, it does not. It gets past him. Run scores. Cerevo leads it 3-1. to one. It looked like Rodriguez wanted to come to the plate, but the ball trickled under his glove. Second error of the inning for Caleb. It'll be a fielder's choice in an error. Petrillo with his 3-2. Swing, and this is a line drive in the center field. Going back is Glassman. He makes the catch. Tagging from third is Ryan. The throw comes to Farrell. Throw to the plate. Bounce to Bursack. Farrell couldn't get it out of the glove. Farrell cut it off. Tried to throw it to the plate. Could not get it out of the glove. Ryan slides in. 4-1 to one, Sayerville. So a sack fly and an RBI for McDonald. Three and two with two outs, so the runners should be off with the pitch here. Calcano at second, McTonic at first. There they go, 3-2, swung on, and this is hit going out to right field. That'll drop in for a base hit. Rounding third is Calcano. Glassman's throw to the plate will be cut off by Farrell. Throw to first, not in time to get H with Tan covering. So Calcano scores on the RBI single from Christian H, his second RBI of the day. And Sayerville now leads it 5-1. to one. H just lunged at it and poked it in the right field. Ahmed with his 1-2. Breaking ball line going down the left field line. That's going to head towards the corner. Brahini should score here without a throw. The throw will go to second. They'll see if Bursak makes it. He does standing up. An RBI double for Alex Bursak, who continues his hot start to the season. And Sayreville now leads it 5-2. to two. And his next pitch. Swing, and this is a chopper going over towards short. Kearns can't get it. Goes into left field off of Kearns. Coming in to score is Kukler. And Sayreville starting to return the favor in the field. It is now 5-3. to three. So the error charge to Kearns scores Kukler. And the Raiders with two in here in the sixth. Two out. The Raiders are down to their final out. And Derek Rossman at the plate. Rossman is 0 for 3 with 3 Ks. Ledzinski with his pitch. Chopper over the mound. Going back up the middle. And picked up by Kearns. Throws on the run to first. Gets Rossman. And this game is over. And so the Sayreville Bombers hang on for the 5-3 win over the North Brunswick Graders. Here at Raritan Bay Waterfront Park in South Amboy. Well, you can't accuse the Raiders of, you know, giving up not without a fight. But, again, just too many errors. Six today. I said seven earlier. Six today in terms of errors for the Raiders. And, obviously, that's not going to be a winning formula. And, thus, North Brunswick drops to one and five. On the season, Sayreville moves to over the 500 mark at 4-3. and three.